What if I told you that the only reason I'm sitting here right now is because you're watching me? Now you think that's weird? It's about to get a lot weirder. I actually exist right now in two suspended superpositions, and only when a conscious observer observes me, the universe splits in half, forcing me to take one position or the other. Now if you thought that was weird, it's actually about to get a whole lot weirder. Did you know that people seriously believe in this crap? I'm not a physicist, but when I hear crap like this, it really pisses me off. So I took the time to go to a quantum physicist and get this all sorted out. Here's how the observer effect actually works. First, we must think, what does it actually mean to observe something? Observing something means bouncing light off an object into a detector that can record the results, like a camera or a human eye. When we pass a large object like a baseball through a detector, bouncing light off it has very little to no impact on its behavior. However, when we pass an incredibly small object like an electron through a detector, bouncing light off it radically affects its behavior. I'm not 100% sure about the following claim because the physicist didn't really specify, but the reason for this is because photons, or light particles, carry a very small amount of momentum due to relativity, and this energy can radically affect the behavior of an electron. But doesn't the observer have to be a conscious being in order for this effect to take place? No, this claim is false. If we set up a detector and the detector records whether an electron passed through it or not on a piece of tape, whether we look at that piece of tape or not doesn't matter. This means measuring very small things becomes difficult because the act of measurement itself affects the results. Without being a quantum physicist, that's about the best I can explain it, but hopefully that makes a lot more sense than electrons being conscious and knowing that you're watching them and altering their behavior based on the fact that you're watching them. If you like this video, subscribe and check out our website at www.logicalmorality.com.